Hello YouTube and welcome to another SQLite tutorial. So today we'll be talking about SQLite index and how to use the command explain query plan. So already let's get started. So in order to use indexes or to explain the use of index, let's first connect to an example or sample DB here called people. So I will connect to my database sample called people. Okay, so let's see the tables that it contains. Actually, there is only one table called user details. Let's see its schema. So as you can see here, it has user ID, which is a primary key and username, first name, last name, gender, password and status so first of all let's display just some uh, rows in order to see how it looks so I will select all from our table user details and I will limit that just to the 10 first rows okay so as you can see here I have a very clear view of my table so the first column, as I told you, it's user ID, username, and first name, last name, gender. Let's count how many actually rows does my table contain. So I will just select count. Okay. From user details. Here we go. So here we have almost or not almost exactly 100,000 records or rows in our table. So let's for example search for a username called bell91. So I will execute a simple query, select all from our user here details, but I have to add a condition where username is equal as I told you to bell 91 okay so as you can see here we have here a runtime a real runtime I mean the time that uh, the query has been executed it's almost 0 0.045 okay second okay so th this is the time of execution of our query so actually we can reduce this time here by adding what we call an index so an index will help us to actually make it our query faster so let's create an index based on the column that we are making the condition which is here username so our cre create index okay so let's name it username index for example because we are indexing our column called username and on our table which is user details and of course we have to provide the column which is username okay so now we have create our index so let's execute the same query based on username bell91 and let's see if we have a uh, time of execution uh, actually lower than that so I will execute the same query here and here we go as you can see we have an execution time of almost zero seconds so because we have added our index we have actually make our query faster okay so actually there is a comment that can helps you to see that in real time which called the explain query plan so I will demonstrate that but before let's uh, actually delete this index first so I will drop my index which called username index username index okay 
I guess I misplayed something. Yes, it's called index as you can see here. Yes, there is no N. Okay. Okay, now we have deleted our index. Okay, so let's execute the same query. Okay, now we have almost 0 0.063, which is all, always uh, slower than the time execution when the index was created. So in order to execute this query, let's proceed it by a command called explain plan. Explain query plan actually. So as you can see here, this command shows us in the detail column that we have actually executed a full scan of the table. So in order for SQLite to find actually the username belt 91, it has executed a full scan of the table here. So let's create another timed index and see what happens this time. So our create index, here we go, we have created. Now let's see with the command explain query plan what happens. So here as you can see this time it has not been scanned the table but it has done search, search table using the indexed table actually as you can see here and the time is always faster than before okay before the index was created so this command actually shows us if we have if affected actually a full scan of the table or if we have done binary search using the index so now you can see the utility of indexes it makes the search very fast but keep in mind that when you add an index it will make your update insert or delete slower because it will it, it have to actually update also the table that contains the index okay that was just introduction to how to use indexes in SQLite as always, I hope it has been informative for you and I want to thank you for viewing. Bye-bye.